guys, buddy. This is me, Pink Star Gamer 66, and today is a brand new Minecraft video. So, today I will be showing you. Well, I won't be showing you anything. I'll be building Bikini Bottom again. So, welcome back to the series where I build Bikini Bottom. Um, so, sorry, I need to fix my camera a little bit. So, uh, let's get out this deal. And so, in the last video that I had made, which was quite a long time ago, building Bikini Bottom, was the Krusty Krab. And so, the Krusty Krab came out really successful. I thought it looks really good because most Krusty Krabs, they take like a long time to build. And the Krusty Krab only took, I think, about two or three or maybe few one video I think I don't remember but it only took me a few times to build it because this isn't the average big crusty crab but it still looks like the crusty crab it looks a lot like the crusty crab so you can make the crusty crab without it being all large and oversized <laughs> so and then I added the flags so there's the American flag the Mexican flag and the other flag that's the England flag I think um but there's a lot of other flags here, like the Krusty Krab has. And then inside, I just decorated it with some chairs. This is the kitchen, the SpongeBob cooks, and that's it. So that's Squidward. Now, Squidward came out perfect. But Squidward has a big nose, like a villager. <laughs> and then this is Mr. Krabs' room. So, um, I tried my best to make it with my just a Krusty Krab without watching SpongeBob. So today... It is going to be the most difficult thing that I'm going to be building. It's probably going to take me a whole bunch of episodes, too. I'm building Sandy's dorm. So, I exactly don't know where Sandy Sandy's dorm is. Isn't it Sandy's treehouse? <laughs> I don't exactly know exactly where Sandy's house is located. I looked it up on the internet a million times, but it, wasn't, but it wouldn't answer me. It just showed Sandy's house um, in the picture. It didn't show, like what was next to Sandy's house. So I just have to build it, and so I'm just gonna build it next to the Krusty Krab and SpongeBob's house. And then I also have to build, uh, and so in the next video, uh, once I finish building Sandy's tree dome, then that's what it's called, tree dome, right? And then I'll start building Mr. Krabs' house, which will probably be like on the other side of the Krusty Krab. So I'm planning on building the whole bikini bottom. And so once I finish building the main houses, I'm planning on, like, building some, like, just random houses like they have in Spongebob, like, where all the other fish live. So once I finish building all the main characters' houses, like Patrick's and Spongebob and Squidward's and Sandy's and Mr. Krabs and all the main buildings that they mainly show, then I'll start building the random little buildings that the fish live in, that the, all the other fish live in. So, I built Sandy's Tree Dome many times, and it never turned out like how I wanted it to. And I think this is a little bit too tall, because Sandy's Tree Dome is round. So I don't have a problem with round. I like circles. I like squares better, but I like circles. <laughs> and you can make, um, you can make circles in Minecraft, just like I did right now with Sandy Street. But the only problem is big circles look really weird. <laughs> um, because in Minecraft, like, if you have a huge circle, I really don't like it. Like, it doesn't look good. Especially on Sandy's Tree Dome, I have to get it perfectly or else it'll have an exact point. And I don't want it to have an exact point. Or else it'll look like a rocket ship. So, um, I have to get this perfect. So I don't want the tree to be too big. Then it, because then it will be too tall, and then plus, from the ground when I look up at the tree, that's the, always the problem with my Christmas trees. I make them too tall, and when I look at up at them, they look all weird because they're too tall. So I have to get this perfect, so I don't have to re, uh, so that I don't have to almost rebuild it like I had to do with Squidward House, Squidward House, <laughs> Squidward's house. So, I think this is enough shortening. Maybe a little bit taller because it looks stubby now. <laughs> I cannot do things while I'm talking because then I mess it up. I'm not good at commentary. I'm not good at commentary. 
while I'm building. Um, then I mess up my words and everything. Well, I do that a lot anyway when I'm not building, when I'm not doing two things at once. But I'm not good at doing two things at once. <laughs> so, I just build or talk. And I like both of them. But when I try to do them at the same time, it normally doesn't turn out good. It normally turn out messing it up. Especially my building and not my talking. I mess up my talking, but I mess up my building even more. So, <laughs> and I rage about my building and not my talking, because I like my talking. So, you know, I don't want to talk too much. I probably already do. Okay, so how does Sandy's tree house look exactly? Hold on, I need to go get uh, something. Sorry, okay, so I just need to get my granny's phone so I can look up to picture Sandy's tree dome. Um, Sandy's tree house. Because I don't have my computer over here or anything. So, because I'm at my granny's. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. So... This is how a picture of Sandy Street Dome looks. So, I guess this is how I build it. So, it's like, it has like the things around the sides. Um, so, I'll just copy off the picture because Sandy Street Dome are one of the things that I'm not the best at. Because I normally don't go off just building random tree houses. So... I've actually never, well, I've built Bikini Bottom before, obviously, but I've never actually, you know, went full out building the whole entire Bikini Bottom. So, it's kind of new to me. And I like new things. So, then, oh, it actually doesn't go out at the front much. It just goes out at, like, the sides. So, if I just go, like, this. And then I go like that. There you go. So, does that look good? Yeah, it looks good. That looks more like Sandy's tree house. Right? Just say yes. <laughs> so. Okay, I guess that looks okay. And then it has like the all the bushes. So you know what? I looked up Sandy's tree house and I didn't look up Minecraft, but it came up Minecraft anyway. I think because I look up so much Minecraft it already knows that I'm trying to talk about Minecraft and not real life. <laughs> Because I look up Minecraft things every day, um, especially Minecraft videos. So, they know me. I'm about to look up something Minecraft, so it just comes up Minecraft. Okay, so it has a whole bunch of trees. So, if I just go crazy with the leaves, because I'm never going to get this done if I go in order. And I'm about to end the video here anyway. Um, I might be able to lift it out a little bit to 11, um, because I don't have YouTube Red, because it just costs too much. $12 for YouTube Red. It's worth it, but, uh, no. So. That looks a mess. This looks horrible. Don't worry, the next video will be fixed up. I just, I'll make it better, don't worry. It just looks horrible because I'm rushing. 
That's probably why. Not because I'm not a good builder or anything. It's just because I'm rushing. <laughs> oh, this looks horrible. <laughs> I'm probably not even going to save this. I'm probably just going to not save it and start all over. Because it just looks absolutely horrible. There's no way I'm fixing this. There's no way to fix it. Um... <laughs> you know what? That's my Sandy Street Elm. I don't care. It's mine. It's my Sandy Tree Dome. So, it looks good to me. It's like all like bushy and round. How do they do that? It's like round. Well, whatever. Um, It'll look better in the next episode. But this is Big Star Gamer 66. I'll see you later. Bye!